These 11 eyeshadow palettes are the icing on the cake to every makeup look that I do. They are the thing that brings life to my face and my personality and I can express myself through these 11 eyeshadow palettes. While my eyeshadow palette collection is pretty minimal and very curated, I feel like I have room to grow and so I do have my eye on several more palettes to buy for 2024. But I love each and every one of these so much. They are all different in their own unique way and I wouldn't part with any of them. So come along with me today as we do my eyeshadow palette inventory in a slightly different way. I'm going to show you swatches of each and kind of just talk to you about my favorite things about each palette. And if you want to see more detailed thoughts and descriptions of the palette, I'm going to link my recent Pan That Palette video below where I go into a little bit more depth about each one. But this is a nice relaxing video. The weather is really crazy outside today and it's still really cold. So I just wanted to do something a little bit warm and cozy to show off my pretty 11 eyeshadow palettes. We're first gonna start with the palettes that you can't get anymore. This is my Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina palette. I love this palette so much because the shimmers in this palette are so smooth and creamy. The mattes are really, really blendable and it offers a really great everyday look. Now let's take a look at my NARS Summer Unrated Palette. This is a limited edition palette from several years ago. The benefits of this palette are that you can get such an everyday look or vamp it up a little bit with some of the purple shimmers or the orange shimmers. It's great for all year long. Lust for Dusk is the only ColourPop palette that I own. I really do enjoy this palette a lot. It offers just the right amount of color in a muted neutral way. And while swatching it, I'm really inspired to use some of the silvery cool tones to create a wintry look. So be looking for that. into Let's Be Brave and add some really bright color. This opens my world to the creamy formulas that Huda offers in the shimmers and her blendable mattes are such perfection. It really opens the door to my love which is my favorite formula of Huda Beauty. By the time I got my Huda Rose Quartz palette, I was ready for some color. Huda really does a great job of creating innovative formulas. The shimmers are usually duochrome, multi-chrome type, type shades, and also there's variety in some of the shades that are swirled together. So Huda Rose Quartz was really me taking a step out of my comfort zone. Huda Naughty Nude was me going back to my comfort zone, but kicking it up a notch. The depth within this palette really impressed me, and I can really work with this. It's user friendly, even though it can go pretty dark and smoky. And 
now I introduce you to my love, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Cosmos palette. This palette is light and airy and dark and smoky and everything in between. I am obsessed, and I don't use that word very often, with the multi-chrome shimmers within this palette. I can't stop staring at my eyes anytime I wear this one. Anastasia Beverly Hills Rose Metals is a fall lover's dream in an eyeshadow palette. It is warm and berry, green, orange, yellow. It's everything that you want in a fall look. I will link my playlist below where I created lots of looks this fall using this one. Persona Identity One Palette is the only Persona palette that I own but it really broke me into the line of Persona and all of the things that it has to offer. This palette is very cool toned, but is the great addition to my eyeshadow collection, which is full of lots of warmth and berry tones. It is very, very pigmented, so a little bit goes a long way. And the last palette is my Tarte Manator After Dark palette, which came out a few years ago. It's great all year long with its pinks and purples and greens and browns. Be careful with this one because the shimmers have a lot of fallout. Thank you so much for watching my eyeshadow palette collection in a relaxing style. Don't forget to check out the video listed below where I give more thoughts and details about each one. Thank you. Bye.